Okay, welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Evolution 2. Now, as you can see, we are still trying to figure out what happened to our uh, to our little, uh, little friend here, who is still twitching all over the place. Now, uh, the Brachiosaur, um, he's a massive creature. And uh, as soon as we have him fixed up, we'll bring him back to his enclosure over there and see how we can continue on from there. Now, the problem I have at the moment is that I am unsure if we can uh, increase the size of this enclosure. Now, the, the, we still have lots of space. We have loads of space over here. We could just simply just make another enclosure over this side instead. Treatment completed. Uh, let's see. What do we have right now? Okay, so he's done. Let's transport him back or her. Well, I don't know. <laughs> I didn't check on the skirt. Bring her back. And, um, yeah, we're still okay. We're still okay. So here goes our little Brachiosaur. Hey, guy, you still... Okay, he still looks kind of wounded. The broke, a broken bone is mended, though. So, all right, that's good. Um, we still need to go a couple hundred more points, almost a thousand more points, to get to the 3,000 uh, value as acid rating that we need. Um, for that, we need to get some more dinosaurs. Now, right now, we have the Brachiosaurus over here. He's going to do all his things. And I think that we have to do a nice little backup, a uh, little uh, enclosure over on this side. I also want another enclosure over here somewhere. So we can, let's see, how, how far back can we go? Up to there. That's as far as we can go for this side. So I'm guessing we're going to have to make another enclosure over here for the Baryonyx. Um, let's see, what do we have? Uh, we still have a couple more, yeah, expeditions. let's see. We have a, more, a couple more dinosaurs we can pick up. We already have the Brachiosaurus and the um, the, the, the weird-looking Triceratops. <laughs> I can forget what the name calls. <laughs> what they're called again. Uh, three Diplodocus, um, Chasmosaurus, Taurosaurus. These are the, basically the same species, but I'm not entirely sure if they can if they like being together. Uh, Parasolophus. Um, those are okay. We can get those. Um, Dionychus, Baryonyx. These are meat eaters. I'm not entirely sure if we should put them all in the same enclosure. I don't think they go very well in the same enclosure. Uh, we'll go for the Parasolophus. Uh, Parasolophil. Oh, yeah, well, <laughs> we'll go for those. And let's see, who can we send? We have, we have, we need four. So I'm going to send Mohanty. Well, I'm not going to send Mohanty. Yeah, I'm going to send Mohanty. Mohanty is done already with the medical treatment thingy, so I can, I can send him. And I'm going to send Inu. Start the task. Great, great, good, good. And I also want to start with some science. We need to do a little bit more research because we do have a couple of things that we want to get done. So research required, enables training of two scientists, gives each scientist two, two training points. Well, it's nice, but I don't have the uh, the necessary uh, logistics for that. So I need to, I might need to have to, I might need to hire somebody else for that. Uh, maybe as soon as we have, let's see, how many, how many points do we have for scientists? Let's see what we got. We have you and you as five points plus three gives us eight well four because that gives us nine in total so we could get the technology the research done when we have all four of our scientists back having said that i think it's probably a good idea to look into either uh firing somebody and getting somebody either or we we train you up we can rest you i don't want to we can rest you i don't want to why can't i train you <laughs> i can't I can't train any of these guys. Why, why, why is that? Um, unavailable during task. Okay, that's cool. Unavailable during task. All right, fine. We can't train them when they're gone. That makes sense. In the meantime, we sent them off for the Paranormal Sophos. Uh, we can put those guys in here or with the Brachiosaur. Um, I think we'll put them in the Brachiosaurus pen and uh, we'll have him uh, just nice and happy in there instead. Right now, let's just continue with making another enclosure. I need another enclosure over here. But first, I need to go do a little quick check on our little Brachiosaur. All right, there we go. But he's doing okay. He's looking at the helicopter. Ooh, mommy. <laughs> That's not your mommy, don't worry. Look at this guy, he's magnificent, isn't he? He's so massive. Huge creature. Are you gonna eat something? Uh, there he goes. There he goes. He's eating something. Or at least it, it looks like he's eating it. Yeah, there he goes. 
<laughs> I like that. All right. So he wanted a bit more forest. We can get him that. Um, I'm thinking of getting another enclosure over here. Big one. So we can move the, uh, the Brachiosaurus over to this enclosure over here. And of course, get the Diplodocus that we want. Uh, those Diplodocus require more open space. Um, so we'll have, we need all the spaces, as much space as we possibly can. I also want the Baryonyx over on this side. So we're going to make a little enclosure over here. I don't think these guys can, do, I don't think these guys want to share. Let's see, do they have enough space? Um, area is, okay, that's, the area is fine. They're happy with the area. So we don't have to worry about that. Let's start working on another enclosure. And let's see, this one over here. I don't want it too close to the road because we want to be able to put these um, these viewing platforms over here. So let's go like that. Can can we can we, let's make it nice and straight? And this doesn't have to be a very big enclosure because the baryonics don't really care much for uh, large enclosures. Luckily, and there we go. And I think we should just curve it down like that. All right, the live capture is in progress. Good. It's working out nicely. All right, there we go. Oh, here we go. All right, we, we lost one, though. So four out of five is fine. I think that'll be it. Transport the dinosaurs. Let's see, where should we put them? I want to put them in here. Uh, I do know that the Ankylosaurus don't like this very much, so I'm going to try and put them over here instead for now. Asset being transported. Asset has been collected. Right there. And um, we're going to try and figure out a way to, uh, to feed them. I'm not entirely sure what they need to eat yet. So they, we might need to transport them back into here instead. And have them walk around these guys. I think these guys don't mind them. Cohabitation, ankylosaurids, yeah, compost. Okay, that's fine. Ceratops, stegosaurus. Okay, they delivered. don't like the ceratops and the stegos, but they don't mind any other ones. Shared with Parasolophus. Um, they want. Okay, they can share it with them. So we could potentially move them back into there if we wanted to. Uh, requires a status check, of course, of course. Uh, I'm not even entirely sure what they eat yet. You guys okay? Yeah, you're fine. <laughs> Let's find ourselves a little uh, ranger. Where is our ranger? Bum, 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 bum. Where, where's my ranger? I don't see my ranger anywhere. He's supposed to be around here somewhere. Somebody eat him? I have the mobile vet is here. Are you in here? No, I don't see you. So are you okay with this cohabitation? See, they don't seem to mind anything else. They, they don't like the sauropods and the Dominus Rex. They don't mind that. Everybody else is fine. But where is my, where's that vehicle? Where's that truck? Oh, there he is. There he is. I found him. I found him. I found him. Let's go. Direct control. I want a status check on those paras. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Those guys can wait. Don't worry about that. <clears throat> I need a status check because I need to know whether the dinosaurs that we just got are happy in our little enclosure and what they need to eat. Is oh ships? Come on. Can we? Can we go? Can we go? Okay, go forward. What's going on? Why, why can't you go forward? Is it is it too much wood? Is that the reason? Ah! Bang! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. The woods here are a little bit too thick. I think that's the reason why he, like, he can't get through here. So we're going to have to go around. Oh, I can't see anything. <laughs> the hood just went right up there. All right, now let's see if we can't get ourselves a couple of pictures of these animals. 
Where are you guys? Excellent. Got to establish a status check. Let's see what they need. What are your needs, guys? Okay, they need uh, open space, which of course we don't have. We only have a lot of forest at the moment. Um, so we might have to move them back in here anyway. Hmm. If they don't have the open space that they need, then they'll, they will definitely rampage. Let's go and uh, let's go and tranquilize them all, and then we'll transport them back into this enclosure here instead. All right, yeah. And let's also start work on expanding this enclosure a little bit more so that we can uh, let's start with the road first. So it's got a road and the road can go right around back there for now. All right, excellent, excellent, excellent. We'll enlarge that um, the main enclosure for the uh, sauropods. And then right there. Excellent. And then we'll remove that path. Just don't remove the fence. <laughs> At least not yet. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Uh, like that. Uh, we could remove this entire fence here. Uh, which will give our... Yeah, let's just do that. Let's just do that. Let's just get rid of this fence. Like so. And that should give our sauropods... I mean, these... these uh, yeah, they, they'll give us... All the things that they need. Then let's transport you over to here instead. Asset to be collected. Asset requiring collection. On route to collect the asset. Collecting asset. Good, good, good. And let's increase the size of our enclosure here. Get as maximum as much as possible out of this enclosure. Bam. Oh, no. Let's go like that. I need to give a little bit of space here. So that we can put some... Uh, viewing galleries in And then like right about there perfect now, let's just demolish this fence Like that there we go How are you guys doing you are perfect excellent everybody seems to be happy 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 as can be <laughs> Let's get the uh, let's get an enclosure. Another one of these guys. This is another ranger. Um, you got a dinosaur threat? Where? Oh, it's you. Oh, he's he's threatening the dino the car. The, the, <laughs> the ranger team already has a little bit of damage. How are you guys now? You guys okay? They're comfortable. Look at the open space is good. Area is good. Good habitation is fine. Ten percent. I'm not quite sure what that means. They don't seem to mind everybody else here. Include source is okay. Cohabitation 10%. It's fine. Okay, good. They're happy. They're happy. Um, what do they eat? They mostly eat ground nut, which is at 100% here. Exactly as we need it. And we need to get uh, the truck. I need one of you. Add task. I'm going to add another task over here. Oh, can we... Tasks? Oh, it's full. Ships. I mean, we need maybe another ranger. Uh, can we get another ranger team? Um, cars, no, advanced scan. And I need, I need another capture team. Rangers. How do I add another capture team? Hmm. Maybe I should just add another response facility. Is that what I have to do? Does that work? Let's see if we can do that. So we already have we have a response facility over here. Let's get let's make another one. Let's build another one. Put that one right up there. Not gonna be in power range, but then we can also add some power here, I guess. Generator, because it's just outside the yellow line. Just, 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 just. Bam. That's up there. Beautiful. Let's get a path going here as well. Like that. That should give us another ranger team. And then we can add this additional task here. 
and also give us some more viewing galleries because we need to be able to see our our little dinosaurs excellent 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 look at that and of course these guys are nice and happy i think everybody should be happy right is everybody happy where are you guys everybody they're all just walking about i think not quite there they are there they are they are comfortable uh open space is good they like it right where they are okay good how about our this guy how's this guy doing he seems yeah, he seems okay he seems fine water is at 11 percent tall nut is at 48 percent uh i need to add some more tall nut though see can we can we do that environment this is tall nut see if we can add a little bit more How was that? Did you enjoy that? Yeah, it's fifty-three percent. He's fine. He's happy. He's happy. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Um, that's good. We, I think that will be fine now. With this, I'm gonna add a task for this guy to do. So you're gonna go over there and do all those things, and uh, be happy with it. Let's go add an additional gate over here. It is a very large enclosure, so multiple gates is kind of useful. We already have two gates on this side. We have one over there, and we want to have one over here. Uh, this will just add um, some more uh, options. Okay, cool. We got the para paras in. Let's see if we can add some more research. Let's see if actually maybe we can train somebody. Let's see if we can train somebody. Control center view scientists. So which one of you, which one of you can I train? I can't train you, can't train you, I can't, why can't I train you? Research required. Hmm. I think they are all at maximum uh, potential at the moment. I don't know. <laughs> Let's see if we can get some more research here. Let's see, that's already done. Don't need to do that. Let's go back. This is all pretty much, we can, we can get this. Large electrified fence. Scientist limit is three, though. We can only put three scientists on this, so we can't get uh, we can't get that research done. Maybe we can see. Can we do it? scientist limit is also three? Bloody hell! And how about you? Uh, scientist limit is there's no limit. Right, so we could potentially get all of them. Oh, it's also three. Bloody hell! <laughs> all right, that basically means we have to fire somebody. And we have to get, let's go get rid of Mohanty. Um, let's see, staff options. I'm going to fire this scientist. Confirm. I am going to recruit another one. Uh, somebody with a large logistics. So this guy, Berke, whatever his name is, he uh, does have quite a large logistics at the moment. That's a good thing. And then we have four, four, three, two, three. I'm going to go for this guy himself. So, yep, confirm take him that's five that's, that's good all right excellent um now we should be able to do the science and still have some scientists available for other things so i want to do the fence first but we do have quite a lot of scientists let's go i need this guy on it and i need um i could get let's see can i get you and you on it yeah start the task all right excellent then they will all three of them will do stuff <laughs> and can we get is there any expedition that we can do with just one scientist that's three six three four uh six as well i need i need more scientists i need more staff options that's what i need okay now let's continue with this enclosure i, I need to get those also done so put a nice little uh gate over there let's add some water going this is the baryonyx enclosure we want to have the uh, kind of large media source. So this is a large watery enclosure. So they, they need a lot of water. That's what they need. And they don't need that much wood, but they do need stone. What's this? I can't use that anymore. So let's get rid of the forest. That can go. I don't need that many trees. Excellent. And instead, we have to go for stones. So a lot of stones. That's what they want. They want... All right. 
excellent. Put some stones on the ground here as well. And let's see if we can raise the terrain a little bit. I like that. You raise it. Yep. Excellent. Makes it look a little bit well. <laughs> still look a little bit crazy. So can we? Can we? Uh, let's just let's just make everything a little bit more. Yeah, more realistic. There we go. Nice little hill instead of a mountain. Get more stones. Stones. Bam, 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 bam. All right, excellent. That's good. Bam. One more stone over there. We'll have a nice little uh, little enclosure here for them. Ready to go. Some more little stones. Research complete. Excellent. Then we, we can now send them out. Uh, to do the job that I that I actually hired them for, let's get more dinosaurs for me. <laughs> That's good. Let's get some more stones over here. One, not the big one. I want this one. Let's see, bam. And I also want a little bit of um, sand. Rock is also fine. Let's see, can we get some some rocks here? Some, a bit of rock, and also on the hill here. And there's also some sand. This is a rock texture. Also quite fine. Cool. And some sand, of course. Some sand right around the edge of the water here. I mean, it's not as bad as the Ceratosaurus. But this is this is just fine. It's like that. There we go. Got a little bit of sand around that. Looks like a good enclosure, right? Yeah, I like it. Alright, now uh, we need the fish pond one over here and i think another one over there beautiful two of them great uh, we still got 12 million so we got a lot of coin so let's see if we can't um don't need to resupply that yet this is also quite okay they this still has a lot of fuel let's send the expedition team out and get ourselves some baryonyx so they got two of them over here near or new orleans let's go send our team they need four so i'm gonna send you aha Excellent. So now that's that's going to go. And in the meantime, I guess my scientists can do nothing. <laughs> we can't do any research, can we? So we yeah, we need we just one short. It's too bad. All right. Well, that's that's too that's just that's just great. <laughs> and the logistics are exactly what we need. How are you doing? You guys are okay. Comfortable is fine. That dislikes also good. You like don't mind all these dinosaurs in your enclosure. Excellent. 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 Cohabitation zero percent at the moment. Uh, water is... You would like to have some more water for some reason. Why do you like water so much? I thought you guys were like sand shrewish type of species. Well, these guys are all nice and comfortable. Population of four is good. <clears throat> Alright, now they're going into the marshes. And they're going to try and see if they can get the big guy. Requires a status check. Okay, what is he, how is he doing? Why are you parking directly underneath him? This is correct. <laughs> this is mad. How are you doing? Yeah. Okay, let's see. How, how is this guy? He is 100% perfect. Bracken poisoning is potential, but for the rest, yeah, he's happy with everybody. He doesn't mind the situation. Tall nuts could be a bit better, but he's okay with that. Water is also fine. You can use a little bit more water though. And open space. He needs he needs forest and open space. <laughs> this is what he needs. Uh, so basically everybody wants more water. So let's, let's just give them a little bit more. Like that. How do you like that? Water, 14%, 16%. It's growing, it's growing. Yes, excellent. And he likes the open spaces as well. He likes the forest. He likes the open spaces. Good, good, good. Medical scan required. Uh, Peter has, has undis... Uh, which one? Who of you has an undisclosed thingamajiggy? Uh, which one? Bloody hell. Okay, let's see. Which, which dinosaur? Oh, that's you. You have something. All right. Let's see if we can't... Um, 
Oh, the bearings have been found. Yay. Uh, continue. The capture has been successful. Excellent. Let's transport the dinosaurs over to the new enclosure. Get them all situated nicely. So one over there. One over there. Excellent. They should be fine. We need a medical, medical scan. Um, so that's, a, the, that's, that's the mobile vet unit. Let's go and give him a task to do. That one and that one. Need to get a nice little checkup. All right, excellent. And here comes the baryonics. Yay! And we also need to include in, in our enclosure a, a ranger post here. So I need some place where I can get uh, quite a significant range. I'm thinking here. <laughs> Let's put it back here, I guess. Yeah. Excellent. And now we also need a, uh, a viewing gallery. Like right there. Need a status check. Soon, come on. Path, um, put that down there. Let's get the new ranger team. Disease contracted. Wait, who's got a disease? Are you guys spreading diseases all over? But yes, they are. So now we have, we have three dinosaurs who got a little bit sick. So I need you to get, get another task. Ah, oh, ships. So they untreatable disease. So what, what diseases that they have? Common cold. <laughs> All right. Okay, okay. We're making progress. But there's always more to be done. For you, anyway. <laughs> Take this next objective, for example. Ensure all kind of dinosaurs have 80%. And, um, yeah, I wish I could do something about that. Uh, ships. Ranger team over here, I need to give you another additional task. You need to come over here and do the uh, status check for these guys. They seem happy enough, as is, but they come in here happy, and then they get all all sniffy and stuff like that, and that's that's the part I don't like. Let's see, let's also add a little bit of shrubbery stuff at. Right on the hill here. Add some plants by the water. Over here, bam, and no, no, I don't want that. And let's put a. No, I don't want that either. <laughs> it's fine. We'll leave it. They seem to be okay, but how do I how do I improve? Oh, we have to fuel you up again. Uh, okay, fill up. How do I how do I how do I heal these dinosaurs? They're, this is a common cold only, and their health is going down. But uh, untreatable disease recovers naturally over time. Okay, fine, cool. Let's just leave them alone. Uh, their health, of course, is pretty low. Well, it's, it's uh, it was pretty high, so it's going to go down a little bit. But that'll be fine. They will get better over time, and uh, that shouldn't be an issue. How are these guys doing? Where where's my uh, my ranger outpost? My ranger, where's my ranger? Where's my ranger squad? I don't know where he is. I see a ranger over there. Are they going? Are they going over there? Yes, they are. Good. I need this this ranger to go and check out our little friends. Hopefully, they won't get eaten. <laughs> so there's some dinosaur over here that has doesn't have 80% comfort, that's for sure. Question is which dinosaur? They seem to be happily munching on the fish. So I don't think it's them. <laughs> My truck is actually a boat. <laughs> Alright, cool. Do your job, dude. Awesome. Uh, you're missing forest. All right. So you want a little bit more forest. I can give you that. I can give you that. So give you a little bit more forest. I'm going to give you some nice little leaf forest over here. And over there. Is that good? Is that good? Comfort is now I need a little bit more. A little bit more. A little bit more. So more forest over there. 
that good? Yes. Excellent. We got a 100% perfect situation. He seems to be happy with the force that we have given him. That means they are... Now, here we go. Look at that. Look at that. We have everybody at 80% and over. Uh, the Baryonyx like it here. Yes. <laughs> this enclosure is perfect for them. Nice. And I don't think that we'll have any problems with them. Not for sure. Not for a long time at least. Let's leave them alone. Uh, they'll be fine. I'm going to go resupply this guy. Resupply you. Fill it up. Thank you. Get everybody nice and... Um, the, the response team is standing by. How are you doing? Um, this capture team over here is doing fine. Excellent. I think everything's okay. And we got one more sick dinosaur still to go, but that's just a common cold. As soon as he is done with being all snippy, uh, he will have 100% uh, health, and that will also go... Look, it's, it's, it's going to go in a bit. Just wait. Just wait. It'll just disappear. <laughs> Everything will be fine. All right, now let's go get some more dinosaurs. What are the next dinosaurs we can get? Expedition map. Let's see. We do have the Diplodocus, and we have the Dionychus, and we have the Chasmosaur and the Taurosaurus. I think that the Diplodocus... And these guys can all pretty much handle being together in one enclosure. I'm going to go for the Diplodocus for now. We need six points for this task. Okay, so I'm going to send uh, these two guys to go get it. All right, awesome, 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 awesome. And we still have seven logistic points in the meantime. Um, I want to get... Oh, here we go. Mission complete! Yes! Pennsylvania is done. Perfect. This is what we'd hoped to accomplish on Isla Nublar. A place where the dinosaurs could finally thrive. Minus the volcano. Obviously. That's a pretty big minus. I think we can all be proud of what we've accomplished here. But? But what? I can hear it in your voice. Okay, okay. I'm just wondering what Dua is really up to. I don't buy all her saving the future by controlling the past talk. Yeah, Lambert mentioned that some of the animals were being moved to an undisclosed location. He wouldn't say, or maybe he didn't know who was taking delivery, but it wasn't the DFW. A third party? You and I are not invited. 